Hi, I'm Lucy, a business apprentice at British Airways. I'm here today to learn about all the things we're doing at British Airways to run our operation more efficiently as part of our BA Better World programme. Can you tell me about some of the changes we're making when we fly to be more sustainable in our operation? Well, at British Airways, we're working towards a more sustainable future and we have a clear path to get us there. But today, I'm going to talk to you about what we're doing to make our operation more efficient. We've been assessing our operation to find and make various improvements, both on the ground and in the air, to reduce our carbon emissions when we fly. We're investing in and flying more fuel-efficient aircraft than ever before. But it's not just these larger changes and investments that the company is making as we make our way to a more sustainable future. Indeed, our operational efficiency program covers all areas of the operation and even the relatively small changes that we can make so the way that we plan, load and fly our aircraft can make a difference in reducing our carbon emissions. Can you give me any examples about how you're making operations on the ground more sustainable? Well firstly, we are replacing our petrol and diesel vehicles that we use on the ground. We have a fleet of emissions-free electric tugs called motor tugs which are used to push the aircraft back from their parking stand. Also, when an aircraft parks on its stand after landing at Heathrow, we turn off the main engines and the extra engine in the tail as soon as we can. Instead, we plug the aircraft into wind-generated electricity to power it whilst it's on the ground. In addition, we are trialling both new electric passenger buses and running our existing buses on HVO. The HVO, which stands for hydro-treated vegetable oil, is an alternative to diesel and is one of the cleanest fuels on the market, reducing carbon emissions by up to 90%. That's great. Can you tell me about what we're doing to be more efficient when we fly? As pilots, we're trained to refine the way we operate the aircraft and consider the environmental impact. Some initiatives include reduced engine taxing. This means powering the aircraft as it moves around the airport using just half of the number of engines available. This can cut carbon emissions by up to 50% during the taxi phase. Flight profile optimization. Now our pilots use the latest wind and temperature information so that they can calculate the most fuel efficient altitude and speed at which to fly. Continuous descent approaches. When landing, we aim to fly a continuous descent, which sees our pilots safely minimizing engine power on the last 15 to 20 minutes of a flight to reduce CO2 emissions and noise. Finally, we try to lower the landing gear at the most efficient time, which also reduces our carbon emissions and noise. We've heard from Sunil about all of the changes we're making on the ground and in the air, but could you tell us some more about what we're doing to encourage operational efficiency? Absolutely. The foundations for us to consider sustainability within our operation uses a fundamental principle of plan, fly, review. During the planning stage of every flight, we're using the latest technology to ensure that each flight has been planned as efficiently as possible. That means using up-to-date weather forecasts and finding the most efficient routings on the day. The review part of this process is probably the most important aspect here. Only by doing this effectively are we able to continuously improve our sustainability of our flights. To support the review process, we've launched new fuel dashboards for our pilots, which gives them insights that help them review how well they're able to reduce emissions during their flights. The more an aircraft weighs, the more fuel it burns, so British Airways is constantly working to reduce the weight of items that are on board. We're gradually replacing some of the trolleys on board, and pilots' heavy manuals are gone, with information now loaded onto tablets instead. Customers' seat back in flight magazines have also gone digital. These small but effective operational changes I've learned about today are a crucial part of our BA Better World programme. Our most important journey yet.